everybody. Welcome back to Hot Tip Tuesday. It's me, Lauren, and I have a hot tip for you today. A few days ago, I was scrolling through Instagram, and if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should. It's at Girls, Goals, and Gong Shows. Pop on over, give me a follow. We have lots of fun over there. So anyway, I was scrolling through Instagram and I came across Pam Shaw's post of her perfect nude lip. And I was like, OMG, this is gorge. Now, Pam and I, I call her Pam as if we're like best friends. <laughs> I wish. We have similar features. I don't have her cheekbones, but otherwise we have pretty similar features. So I was thinking, hmm, maybe I could rock that nude lip. So I went ahead and gave it a try. Here it is right now. I posted a picture of it and my DMs and my Facebook messages just blew up of people saying, what is this nude lip? We want this nude lip. What shade is this? What combo is this? And people were just like going crazy for it. And it got me to thinking. And that is what your hot tip is about today. Okay, so here's what it got me thinking about. We are in a world of lip kits at the moment, are we not? Everywhere you see, as far as the eye can see, it's all about these lip kits or liquid lips or sets of lip kits, da 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 da. And we have like three, and they're pretty awesome. They're at a little bit higher of a price point, but we only have three. We have red, we have a plum, and we have a rose, which is kind of more of a terracotta, which is great and which is fabulous, and I do love them and believe they definitely have their place in our product lineup. But after I did this particular lip, I got to thinking, because y'all know me by now, I like to think outside the box. I can't compete with Kylie. I don't take pictures of my babushka. I don't have a private jet to take pictures. I am not getting Gucci like Jeffrey. I don't have some huge big name celebrity like Christy or whoever else in the industry these days is doing makeup and everybody is like purchasing from them. I can't keep up with that lifestyle. I'm just a mom and pop business. What about you guys? But I believe that I have better products than they do. And so if I could only mirror these buzzwords that they are using, maybe I can at least keep up with these trends with my own product lineup that I firmly believe is priced better and better quality than most of the rubbish on the market these days. And so here's what I did. I created my own lip kits. Stay with me on this. Pam shared that her favorite nude lip is naturally buff with pink parfait. Now I had personally never done that combo, but I immediately did. I went and put these two together, pulled them off my shelf, and I played with them and I was like, it's the perfect nude lip. This by itself, not the perfect nude lip. This by itself, not the perfect nude lip. Can they be used separately? Absolutely, to attain a different look, but together they are best. So why, oh why, don't I start offering lip kits? Are they in our magazine? No, but does that matter? I do most of my marketing on social media anyway, legally. Or I do it at my parties or my facials when I'm talking to my customers. And so why not put together my own lip kits? And nobody will ever know, correct? So I came up with the Naturally Buff Lip Kit by Mary Kay. And so what this lip kit contains is Naturally Buff Lipstick with Pink Parfait. It comes together and it's beautifully wrapped and it can be yours for just $30. A lipstick and a lip gloss, both able to be used by themselves or put together for just $30. Now, for retail price purposes, this retails for 18, this retails for 15. Put that together and you've got $33. I knocked a few dollars off because 30 felt prettier. So that's how I'm doing it. And I've had a lot of success with it in just a few days. And to me, this is like such a novel idea and just such a fun idea, and it's all back to kind of what I taught you about the palettes last week, right? We've got to think outside of the box if we're going to keep up with our competitors. And so this is the first of the kits that I put together, and I just wanna show you a couple others. I want you guys to know that there's no limits on this. It's limitless. Mix and match your favorite pairings and create some fun names or create something unique and different. This is the first, this is the Naturally Buff, and what I'm also offering is the ultimate Naturally Buff lip kit set to which I add in the lip liner that goes with it. There are ultimate sets like this out there retailing right now for like $78. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm not gonna pay $78 for that. No, not happening. So I can at least market this to my customers for actually under 50 bucks. 
Hello, totally crazy, totally amazing. Okay, so do you wanna see a couple of my other that I have just recently put together? Okay, so I took off my Naturally Buff and the next one I'm going to show you is the Rich Truffle Lip Kit. Now this one is Rich Truffle paired with Golden. And how about this one? Isn't this a fun autumn color that you could wear all season long and just match the changing colors of the trees. Let me show you a couple more. Probably one of my favorites, I am calling this the Appleberry Lip Kit, and it's our Appleberry Lipstick with our Sparkleberry Lip Gloss over top. I live for this pairing. I love this berry lip. I think it's so fabulous moving into the holiday season, and this color looks so good on just about everybody. It's a very safe bet. For you to sell to people. If somebody's looking for a great kind of holiday, fall, berry lip, I would always dive into this first. There's very few people that this doesn't complement. The last one I'm going to show you is this Sassy Fuchsia Lip, lip Kit. Don't think that you have to just use our gel semi-shines or your gel semi-mattes. You can use any of our lipsticks because we're they're all pretty much priced the same. This one I'm going to use Sassy Fuchsia and then I'm going in with Shock Tart over top. How about that for a pop of pink? I also really like this one. I tend to wear this more in the summer, but I think, I mean, if you wanna rock it all year round, you definitely can. The combinations are endless, and I know you're sitting there thinking right now some of your favorite combos. I mean, how many of you wear a lipstick with a gloss over top of it? Most of you probably have at one point or do still. Go back and find those favorite combinations of yours and make them into a lip kit and sell them. And like I said, I'm doing mine for $30. And then if you wanna add in the perfect pairing of a lip liner, you can and make it your ultimate lip kit. What you sell it for is up to you, remember. If you wanna do a deal on it, great. If you don't, that's, again, that's totally up to you. But I always like to do a little bit of a deal on it just to make the bundle worthwhile and as a great kind of pitch to people saying, you know, normally it's this, but I'm offering this bundle at this particular price. Mix and match, have some fun, do some different pairings, and start trying to do these lip kits in your sales. And I promise you that people are going to jump on board with it. And remember, the more excited you are about it, the more your customers are going to be excited about it. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in this Tuesday. I hope that you found some value in this and that it blesses your business in some way, shape, or form. Now head on out there and go sell those lip kits to your customers because you can compete with the Kylie's of the world. You just gotta think like a Kylie sometimes. If you guys have any questions or need clarification, please feel free to post in my comments below. I love hearing from you guys. And remember to go pop over and follow me on Instagram at girls, goals, and gong shows and stay up to date with me in between. And if you don't mind, click subscribe and definitely hit that bell as well so that you get notifications of when my new videos pop up. All right, I hope you all have a wonderful week and I will see you next week for another edition of Hot Tip Tuesday. See you guys later.